of us really could Guys, so we have a big video today. We have a new apartment, we moved, so my head is a lot clearer, I feel better. We have a, a new haircut, so my head is a lot lighter, I feel better. I think I probably lost a whole two pounds on my head. A new outfit, Jack Italian 2.0, fresh little fit. And um, unfortunately, we do not have a new girl. Your boy gets no bitches, zero females. Uh, zero female attention in my life, but that leaves one more new thing, um, a new car. So. We're gonna go, I'm gonna show you guys the new vehicle. Master negotiator for vehicles. And um, yeah, when we get there, I'll show you guys and uh, kind of talk to you guys about why I got it and uh, what my plans are with it. Big, big video. And I'm excited to show you guys, share this moment with you. I got my chicken and rice, chicken and asparagus. No, not even rice. What's up, daddy? Look, my dad's in the Anaka Basics. It's not all to knock it out. Just wait till I start my own clothing company. I wanna talk to you guys about that in this video as well. Your boy's becoming next level. We're gonna level up. Level up the channel, level up the life, and level up y'all's apparel and accessories. With the Italian branding. All right, let's fucking, let's go get it. Ah. <laughs> All right, so Sam just adjusted the lighting. Thank you, Sam. All good now. But um, we're driving over, mullet looks good. You know what comes with a good mullet? Cocaine issues. Um, I've never done coke in my life, I'm joking. My fucking nose just exploded blood in the front seat of the car. I have no idea what happened. I just like kind of like was sitting there and I was like, what the fuck is in my throat? Like, why does it feel like something's dripping down my throat? And I bent over and just blood started coming out. So Sam pulled over. I went to a gas station. Hiroshima from my nose popped out. Blood and guts everywhere. It looked like the movie. In middle school, this girl had her period on a lunch seat. And this other kid licked his finger and dipped it in the blood and then ate it. And said it tasted like Pringles. Cut on a dare. I don't know why he did that. Fucking weirdo, bro. He was actually adopted from Africa. Um, so he probably just didn't understand what the fuck was going on. I don't know what else the fuck's going on. My dad's in the backseat probably like, what the hell is going on right now? But, uh, I love you guys. I'll catch y'all at the dealership. Just know that, uh, a very high blood pressure. <laughs> <laughs> I love the idea of a Bronco. I've said this for probably nine months to you guys. There's this one, which is dope, but it's way too expensive. Wild track. What is the sticker on the wild track? It's like 80K, bro. How you doing? Hi, I'm Marco. Is it okay if we film a little, yeah, some portions? Of Perfect. Oh, that's the Bronco Raptor? Yes, that's the Bronco Raptor. But they're sick, damn. It even has the whole Raptor grill. Dad, what it's do you got think? got the huge fenders on it. All right. What do you think, Dad? It doesn't work. It's broken. It's the door is broken. broken. I feel like I belong here at a Ford dealership with my mullet. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna fuck my sister. It, I'm gonna bang the shit out of my sister. You don't like white? No, I'm not. What are you racist? Damn, this is the white one. Damn, it's kind of short. Yeah. Is the key to start it up? Oh yeah. Oh, it's quiet. Quiet, yeah. It's very quiet. What you thinking? I don't know if I like white. You don't know if you like white? I haven't, I haven't paid for any more. Do you want to go look at the other color? Yeah, I might look at the other the, color. I'm not gonna lie, I don't like it. Yeah, I didn't think you did. Mm. I don't know, the white one just was not doing it for me. And the price difference is very minimal. I like white as a color, and I was like, oh, maybe I'll change something up and get a white car. It's so feminine. I look like I just <laughs> guzzle penis. I look like I just swallow loads for a living if I drive a white Bronco. Actually, that's so true. Dude, I can't do white Bronco. My name's not Becky and I don't go to college. I'm not in Kappa Delta at Arizona State. Taco Bell mild hot sauce. Absolute necessity. Digestive enzyme pill. Some chicken and an onion or digestive enzyme pill is covered in hot sauce. I have to swallow it without chewing it. Let me have some mustard, a little asparagus. Yeah, guys, I saw the white one in pictures and I was like, oh, dude, that's so sick. I got here, I'm like, motherfucker, I'm taller than this shit. This is too small for me. MSRP on the Bronco, the Raptor is 80K. So 80K is MSRP and they were charging 105. I was like, fuck no, I'm not, but I'm not even interested. And then the other one is MSRP on that one. The Wild Track was like 67. And she offered it to me at sticker at 67, but at 67, like making payments and everything, my car payment, my goal is to have a car payment of like four to $500 per month on like a 72 month term. So if you guys understand cars, it's a very small car payment for a long period of time. So it doesn't take a lot out of my pocket um, with minimal down. Like obviously like I don't want to spend money. I want to spend the least amount. And yeah, it just didn't make sense. So sometimes you live and you learn. You guys got to make smart financial decisions. As I'm growing up and maturing, I'm realizing I need to make more smart financial decisions and like be less impulsive on things. So I 
thought about it, came all the way here, looked, and it's just not, it's not doing it for me. So I get no bitches, but I do have still a special guest yeah. for the YouTube video. He is definitely, does not look like a woman in any way, shape, or form, but at least my hair looks good, bro. At least I got a nice mullet. Dude, we got the boy. I told you guys we had a special guest. No car or car. They we still have Jack. <laughs> Dude, that stuff is bro. dark, bro. It's dark. I use the Anaka cookies and cream, like, sample. I use the cookies and cream flavor. It's definitely very dark, but I'm assuming it's gonna be, like, very, like, Oreo-based, so I'm excited to give it a shot. Mix my ice cubes in. Jack. Jack, Jack is like he's fucking reminiscing, bro. When he got sprayed down in the fucking battlefield, and then the Jack was in active duty, just getting fucking massacred by bullets. <laughs> and then, uh... And then he was just resurrected and turned into this fucking behemoth. He was he was 120 pounds when he first got lit up with bullets. And then he just fucking ate all the bullets, the nutrients. <laughs> Alright guys, we're gonna fucking manscape my armpits on my balcony for all of my neighbors to see. I'm a little bloated from all that cream of rice. But... <clears throat> that should be good enough on this one. Oh my god, this a fucking bush. <laughs> I hope this like lands in someone's pool. It lands in someone's pool. Um, dude, imagine I almost just fucking shaved my head with the manscaped. That'd be fucking crazy. You look like that kid. I'd be bald, bro. Yeah, Damn, bro. I had hella chest hair. It died. No fucking way. It died. I shaved half my chest. I shaved half my chest. Like this part has hair in it. This part doesn't. It's not even turning on. Can you pull them out with tweezers? Pull the rest why of my Why don't you just whack it? I can pull them out, that might be a little painful. Ah, uh, will you bite them out? Like, <laughs> each individual hair? I don't even see any hair to start with. What yeah, it's kind of hard to see it. Ah! <laughs> I didn't get it. I love this jacket. I've been wearing this non-stop, bro. Spit in my face, my love, I've gone crazy. Spit in my face, my love, I've gone mad. That song stuck in my head from TikTok, dude. I need to fix my hair. I look like a fucking. I look like I literally like might kiss my cousin on the lips. I definitely look like I kiss my grandma on you the lips. Look like Peso Puma. That's what Who I the said. fuck is Peso Puma? You need to get more in touch with the Mexican culture if we're gonna be friends. Bro, I love Mexicans. Fucking use Code Italian on Anaka Subs Code so that I can take Sam with me to Mexico and make a budget vacation. Like I wanna, I wanna go on budget budget vacations for my YouTube where it's like. You have a fifteen hundred dollar budget, and you want to go for six days, right? So me six and Sam, days. oh yeah, like six. You have a week off, like Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Maybe you got to fly back, or like six to ten days. But like, how far can you get fifteen hundred dollars to stretch in like Tulum or Cabo or another place in Mexico? Code Italian on Anaka Sups or Flex Pro or Anaka Clothing or Transcend HRT. Or you guys want some fucking hormones? Your OnlyFans? Yeah, you guys can buy my OnlyFans. I don't have an OnlyFans, <laughs> but um. All right, so we're teaching Jack how to make the cream of rice. He got 90 grams, I get 60. Granular sweetener, pure stevia. I'm always lazy with it, bro. If I was making, I, I stopped eating cream of rice because I just. And then I, I am using rice protein just because I don't have a lot of Anaka samples to give you. We'll take like, what, like two scoops? Yeah, give me two, please. Like that? Yes, please. And then. Bro, I saw the shit he was putting into his. Like, damn, I don't be going that hard. <laughs> Man, this if you want, if you want, mix this up. Yeah. And then I have 20 grams of peanut butter. Um, I ran out of almond butter. Jesus Christ! <laughs> you just dab me in there. You mix it in. You don't leave it on top like that. I'll mix it in. So you see how there's like like 60 percent of the bottle left? Use all of it. First <laughs> 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 But you gotta mix this like you. Isn't this too much fucking work? It does look like dog food. You know what, dude? <laughs> Toss my salad, okay? <laughs> all right, here we go. And then we have. This looks better than my oats. I'm not gonna lie. I don't. I don't get all fancy. And then you got. Wait, wait, wait. You got a little dash of cinnamon. Look at that. Give it a little taste test. I'm a little nervous. <laughs> Honestly. Okay. It's a lot better than I thought it was. It's pretty fucking good. Right? Pretty fucking good, yeah. Um, we have Rise Fuel mixed up in our Helimix. I have no code for Rise Fuel. They just fucking hook it up. I have like 12 cases in my fucking house. Helimix, my little brother's code, code Mo. Just showing a little low love to little bro. I'm happy for him to have a sponsorship, so every single time I have an opportunity to tell you guys if you guys want to support my little brother or me, code Mo on Helimix. Then you guys will get all the other plugs and shit later in the video. Don't worry about it. Oh, I can't punch it because I'm going to break my hand. I just, I pulled back because it's all plastic cups. You're making smart decisions right? on the prep. You've really grown into your own. Alright. <laughs> Dude, it's always Helimix touched my knees. 
for real. Bro. They still send me new healing every tattoos. Week. Yeah, every week. There's a new week. There's a new bottle every week at the house. That's why I'm so happy to like show some love right now to them because like they really do hook it up. Oh, this has a note in it. It definitely says don't show us yet, but I'm going to show you guys anyway. The Burgundy Helomix drops on April 19th. Okay, so it's already dropped. Here, here's the uh... Ooh, fuck. That's nice. Oh, it's burgundy, bro. I like this one better. You want the pink one? No, I don't care. No, I want the pink one. <laughs> what code do they use? Code Mo. Yeah, code Mo! Code Mo! Yeah, you know what I mean? Like, it's like a, you're getting rid of the... We're here at the gym, about to hit back. I'm gonna take Jack through a back workout, back and biceps. I'm gonna be coaching Jack through <laughs> Wait, this workout. Dude, Perfect long introduction long. to Jack Italian coaching. I'm gonna talk to you guys a little bit more about that at, after the workout, but um, coaching is gonna be available now. So Kyle's been mentoring me for about eight months now, and I really just wanna benefit as many people as I can. Aside from like what Kyle's done for me, changing my life throughout like this bodybuilding prep, I'm in a, the best mental state I've been in a long time, happiest about the way I look, the healthiest as far as like blood work even though I'm on cycle my blood works better than it's ever been and I really think it's down to like training and holding some having someone to hold me accountable and just looking forward to eating clean and my skin's clearing up a lot like I learned a lot from this prep and I want to share that value with people I love you guys we're gonna go hit this workout and I'll catch on a little bit always what are you talking about you know they're comfy yo Jack West he gets his name because he's from out west bro Fucking Native American over here. Look at his feet. Look at them. What are you talking about? Bro, They're comfy. you look like you're from fucking... I mean, I'm not hating. They look mad comfortable. Looks like you were, uh, what's it called? Looks like you live in a cave and, like, ride horses. These are German handmade. What are oh, you man. talking about? Heflingers, baby. German or Germane, maybe? German. <laughs> Go bust really good. 
stick a pin through it. It's kind of freaking me out. It says paper thin. <laughs> what the fuck? And then all the ab veins are coming through and shit. This is low-key, like get from that side of the mirror. Is this ab veins, the obliques are better? Get coached by the Jack Italian. Technically Kyle, because Kyle's mentoring me, but I swear to God, one day I'm gonna be like one of the fucking top dogs. I already proved it with the bodybuilding shit, I'm not gonna lie, like, once this fucking show's won, once we have this shit in the bag, I prove I can fucking accomplish anything I put my mind to. And everyone who fucking believed in me, I appreciate you guys more than you realize. Bro, Marco, don't <laughs> I was gonna break the beam. Bro, I thought I was going through the mirror. I thought I was going through the mirror for a second. Three, two, one, go. Oh, that looks so cute. What's up guys, about to go hit legs. Saturday, May 13th, we have a huge Anaka drop and I really wanna share some of the items with you guys. I just picked out a lot of my favorite stuff because I don't wanna waste your time and Sam's gonna make this shit quick, pop some photos up on the screen as well. So we have the new Anaka button down tees. I love these, they're like the short material, one ply, super like light, weight for summer. They also come with matching shorts. Right here, these are double, like the two with upgraded strings. They have like lock tips, like nice lace tips over here, a cut on the side to make your leg look a little bit more defined. The fuzzy patches, it comes in four colorways. We got this like salmon rustic colorway, uh, a gray, I think a green or a cream, and then the black. Same thing with the pants, which the thing I love about the pants, I'll actually throw these on and see how they fit. This is an extra large pair of pants. They were also extra large shorts. This is a large shirt, because your boy is fucking skinny now. I'm filling this out. But I love these, bro. The whole side buttons, so if you guys wanted to like rip them off, they're basketball pants inspired, so they're sewn at the top, but the bottoms are all clippable. They're like the uh, March Madness inspired clothing drop. We have two sets right here, the script sets. Those are actually super sick, I like those a lot. Very easy to kind of just put together. And um, then we also have five basketball shorts dropping. And then we also have an additional four colorways of these. Just don't happen to have them yet. And then there's also three hats. The Anaka basketball hat, Anaka, and Anaka. Then we have 13 shirts, but I'm just show you guys my favorites. I don't wanna fucking take them all out of the package and show you if you don't wanna fucking see it and waste your time. So this is all March Madness inspired for the basketball tournament. This is one tee I like a lot. This is another one, super simple on the front. The Anaka print and then the Anaka on the back. So this one kind of gives me like a graphic, like a, a vintage graphic, which I like a lot with the cracking. So like I was saying, May 13th, 11 a.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Central, Coda Town on the Anaka drop. Also, if you guys made it this far, you guys deserve to be rewarded, so I'm gonna give away two $100 gift cards. To anybody who comments on the video, just comment your favorite item. Also comment some other shit about the video, like say you guys are enjoying it or something. Me and Sam are having a great time doing this, and like I've never had this much fun on YouTube in a long time. I love you guys, and I hope you guys pick something up from the drop. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of this fucking video, and I hope one or two of you win that $100 gift card. <laughs>